three unit bridge here from the cuspid to the premolar. You can see that this premolar is pontic but previously had some endosurgery or something it looks like. Um, number four is failing, it's, it's, it's fractured. So we're going to be removing this, cutting this, placing an implant here and doing a provisional here and then taking this, removing this tooth and um, placing some bone graft. That way she can have an aesthetic tooth um, and not have to transition with a stay plate. But because of the bone loss in this area, we're not going to be able to do an immediate implant. Plus, looking at the x-ray, the apex of number four is pretty much right at the base of the sinus, whereas there's a lot more bone height in the number five site. You can see we're angled a bit toward the facial, and um, the reason why is because there's such a depression here. Mm -hmm. um, the edge of the bone is here and then the edge of the implant is about three and a half millimeters down which is great we want you know we want this to be three to four millimeters but we'll have to profile the bone this is a bio horizons profiling system you put in a little guide and then um, there's a little truck one that goes around. Okay. See how that profile now So while we're doing the cross part, we put some um, cotton in the in our access and with some hemodent, painting the inside of our polycarb with acrylic monomer. Index our crown. Okay, go ahead. Okay, now bite together. Good. Slide to the right like you did before. Okay, slide straight forward. Good. Okay, open. 
Okay, so we got our uh, tooth out and the so socket bone grafted, and then we placed another implant and did an immediate provisional, and it's out of occlusion, so take a look at this in a couple of placing an implant in the number four site. Um, previously, she had a bridge, bridge from four to six. And so what we did is an interim thing is we did an immediate implant in number, well, we did an implant in the number five site, an immediate provisional, took out number four and bone grafted the socket. That's healed. Um, and now we're going to place the implant in the number four site. Okay, a lot of pressure now. This is a two-week post-op of the implant in the number four site, and um, a little closer view. We had taken out number four, grafted that socket, and in the pontic site, we had placed an implant in the number five area, and with an immediate provisional. And um, now, in about a month, she's going to be ready for the to restore the implant in the number four site. Here's our X-ray. Right there you can kind of see where we push the sinus up a little bit. This is a six week healing of the implant in the number four site. The number three site, um, probably looking at more like three or four months. And she's ready to go for the restorations. We'll take a look at the x-ray next and then we'll be looking at the final restorations. These are the final restorations in the number four and the five spots. And. Um, We'll take a look at the x-ray next. 